Hello friends, subscribe technology and press the bell icon to never miss the updates. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel technology and in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to fix FTP server error on your open game panel. So you just need to follow me and don't forget to subscribe my channel for more update. So without wasting any more time, let's start the video. So as you can see, I'm already installed one open game panel on my computer. And if you don't know how to install open game panel on Windows computer, then I have already made a video on this topic on my channel. So you just need to go to my channel after that scroll down and um, here is the video as you can see how to install open game panel on Windows VPS. So I, I will also give you the link to my video description. So don't worry about that. So a few people are getting uh, error on FTP server. So if you if they will click on uh, click on login on their FTP. So as you can see, one error is showing over there. So FTP is not uh, login correctly. So I will going to show you how to fix this problem. So for that, you need to uh, go to your uh, Google Chrome, uh, open your Google Chrome or any browser. And after that, you have to download FileZilla server. So you have to go to this first website. It's called filezilla project.org so click over there so as you can see there is two version of uh, filezilla available one is filezilla client another one is filezilla server so you have to download both the version from here so as you can see here i have already downloaded one uh, filezilla client on there and server over there so i have to install this filezilla server on my computer so just double click over there and click on i agree and then next and if you want to uh, see the source code, then you can check this button. After that, click on next and then next and click on install. So now, as you can see, the installation is complete. So close it. So after that, you have to click on OK. So now it's done. So we'll just minimize it. So now I'm going to install FileZilla client. This one is my FileZilla client. So this one is not for your uh, server. This one is uh, whenever you access your FTP server, then it will be uh, this FileZilla client will be required. Okay. So I will install FileZilla client also on this computer. Stop icon. Next, next. So as you can see, the installation is complete. So click on next and then click on finish. So now it's done. So minimize it. So uh, now I have to open the FileZilla server on my computer. So here is the FileZilla server as you can see. Here is the FileZilla server. So uh, what I have to do is you need to click on edit and then settings. Sorry, uh, you have to go to the edit and then user. So now you have to create one user account over there. So if you want to uh, log in with same username and password, then you have to create one account user account with one. Okay, so I will show you how to do that. Just click on add and then the, choose the username to one and then click on OK. Now check the password box, this password box. After that, copy this password. And after that, just paste over there. And after that, click on shared folder. And as you can see, I'm already installed one uh, counter strike uh, uh, HLDS on over there. So uh, you just need to copy this location. Just click on edit. Just copy this location. And after that, you have to paste on this location. So uh, this folder is under so you need to uh, access this folder. So just go to under C drive and after that, uh, just choose OGP over there and choose home folder. As you can see home, under home folder, multi mode, matrix multi mode uh, 2016 is available. So here is a folder as you can see. So you have to choose this home folder and click on OK. And after that, you have to click on OK. Now uh, click on FTP and try to log in once again 
just click on login so as you can see it's working properly so ftp is working properly now i'm going to show you guys how to log in from your if uh, filezilla client so just uh, copy paste this ip without port don't port uh, don't paste this port over there just put the ip and after that username one and then password sorry the password is here and after that the uh, this port is you need to paste on there like 21 is port after that click on quick connect so as you can see it's connected successfully so i hope this video will really help for you and please don't forget to click on the subscribe button and like button and share button and i will see you guys in the next one take care